Is the earth flat or round? One last thing, which should be obvious, okay. if you pay attention and think about it. If you send a ship straight to the horizon, right. eventually it begins to disappear until it's no longer visible beyond your horizon. Right. And you should ask yourself, what kind of surface would produce that result? One of the things you can see yourself with a pair of binoculars is if you actually go out to a lake and there are boats on that lake, the farther away a boat is, the more the bottom of the boat will disappear and you'll basically just see the mast of the boat. And as a boat goes farther and farther away, the last thing you will see is the very top of the mast of that boat. And that's because the boat is actually going over the horizon that's curved. And that means that as it goes farther and farther away, you see less and less of the bottom of it and more of the top of that. You can see that with binoculars, by an ocean, by a lake. It's really easy. That wouldn't happen if the Earth were flat. You would simply see the boat getting smaller and smaller and smaller as it went farther away, but you'd be able to see the whole thing with the same proportions. started saying, I'm using laws of math and physics to show Earth is flat. Those are fighting words. You're going to say using math and physics? That is an alarm to the Geekiverse that we must rise up. Seafarers knew this. Right. And so, what, however flat they would have imagined the Earth to be, they, they, couldn't, have, they couldn't have accepted it to be completely flat, because otherwise you would never not see the ship. Go to the uh, seashore, go to a seashore and figure out why you can't, if you live on the East Coast, figure out why you can't see Spain from the East Coast of North America.